Greetings and welcome back to Victoria 2. Alright, so we are still in the red for now. But uh, I am going to uh, upgrade this factory actually. Because uh, we do need plenty of furniture even though there's not that high of a demand on the uh, market. But uh, as you can see, I do need uh, 144 for my own people. So. That's totally fine, although I'll have to import a lot of timber, since I don't really have that much on my own, but... Oh well, let's see. Okay, well, I'm gonna have to wait for some of the buildings to be completed. Well, some of the factories to be completed, and I'm gonna have to find some uh, other source of income. I am gonna get business banks soon, and uh, that should increase my tax income a little bit, so that could help. Now, where is this? Wait a minute, what's this? Uh, oh, poor war, okay, never mind. I almost uh, read it as Great War. <laughs> Hmm. I'm gonna make sure that I don't... Yeah, it's... Well, but uh, once these factories are done, I should be getting a little more money perhaps, because we'll have a bunch of people, unemployed craftsmen, going to work. Those guys will be paying taxes, so that should help. What the hell? Okay, so apparently these guys decided to build a liquor distillery. Um, well, it's not ideal, but then again, it's not too bad since uh, I need a bunch of liquor. So, send in the troops. Um, no, let's, let's get some prestige instead. Because prestige is good. Gotta make sure that I remain a secondary power. Okay, alright. Uh, only 200 points behind uh, Austria-Hungary. And there we go, tax efficiency. So, uh, let's take a look. Netherlands, Japan... Yeah, well, that's a lot of points. It's gonna be very difficult to get... Uh, to become a great power. But you never know. Um, what else? Yeah, the Netherlands mostly has prestige, and uh, you can lose prestige if you lose a war. He's actually at war with uh, China at the moment. Let's take a look at China. We're at war with a lot of people. Okay, that's interesting. And this isn't a great war. Uh, Chinese liberation of something. And China is losing this one badly. Okay. Oh, what? Well, uh, gotta do some research. So I'm gonna need some more uh, research into things that make me money because I'm losing too much. Cheap steel could work. Um, railroads. Railroads could help, but uh, not immediately, as I'm gonna need to build them first, and that takes about, uh, I don't know, two or three years. So let's go for uh, private banking. Take a look here, so this one's almost done. That's good. Got some more projects apparently. Uh, actually, some projects should have been finished. I guess uh, the distillery was the only one, but I remember seeing a lot more projects. Perhaps some of those were uh, railroads that I built myself. I really should uh, check this if anyone wants to build a railroad. So, actually, I Let's take a look how many capitalists I actually have. They're probably all in Kano, I would assume. Uh, oh no, wait, let's take a look here. I got whatever found in. Oh, yeah, well. And that is the uh, bad news <laughs> that I talked about earlier, uh, last episode. So, yeah, there goes our iron supply from back here. And uh, if this was a thing, that I knew before that uh, it would happen, then I certainly wouldn't have gone 
through all the trouble to take over this uh, state. That could have saved me a lot of trouble early on and could have saved me a lot of trouble in my uh, war against the Spanish because I could have just uh, taken uh, Cameroon for example. Would have been very useful and probably would have been able to uh, get quite a bit of naval supply from uh, this place. Either way, um, yeah, we're still making ships and now we have a lack of iron that's also why i didn't want to upgrade the ammunition factory but uh, how much are we producing at the moment uh, 7.1 oh yeah that reminds me i should be putting a migration focus here and let's get rid of yeah, which one do we get rid of i guess in benin we have uh, enough people there for now or in Biafra. Uh, let's get the one in uh, Biafra actually. There we go. I want more, more people to work here. I want to fill up this place. As you can see, it has a lot of potential. It should be going up soon. Should have a bunch of migration already, and uh, now that, it was, that we stimulated, we should have even more. So, excellent integration. Um, yeah, we should be integrating it. It's gonna cost me a little bit of infamy. That's totally fine. Okay, there we go. I didn't read uh, everything, but. Uh, did have much of a choice. Well, I did have some choice, but uh, I just wanted to go for integration, if possible. Though I don't know if I will ever get a core back here. Normally cores should spread because of the mod, but I haven't seen it happen yet, oddly enough. And Spain seems to be having more issues with the uh, rebels. Uh, more rubber. And in Fondo, whatever the hell it is, uh, back here, okay. As long as uh, this place doesn't get any rubber, I'm totally fine with it. No. I'm gonna need more money. <laughs> we'll have a private banking soon. Uh, tensions into Kari. Nope, it's ours. So that I go in the green soon because I really need money. What about factories? Um, Europa States, okay. I guess I could build another one, although I'm gonna have to be careful where I spend my money. So, what else could we build back here? Or maybe I just upgrade the uh, luxury factory. Let's see, it makes about uh, 1.3 and I need 3. Well, that's not much. I guess one extra level could work. Although we probably don't have any... Oh yeah, we still have some tropical wood. I hope that it uh, remains there. I'm gonna upgrade it again. I hope that I don't lose this tropical wood here. It's a uh, 58. It's not bad. It's enough. And we got some railroads. Excellent. That should increase income just slightly. And we got administrative efficiency. And apparently, uh, the French are at war with the Spanish for something. Uh, let's see. Oh, well, this. Well, it's not exactly a great war but uh, it's close enough we got the French versus Germany that's not gonna end well he's gonna get steamrolled over there yeah I think France is screwed and uh, I should be getting research of course so let's take a look hmm maybe Maybe 
let's get the cheap steel so that I get more iron production oh, and we are about to go in the green that's nice uh, not for long though but uh, it's just stabilizing I can only hope that it uh, remains that way we're still upgrading everything and also back here oh for fuck's sake well, there goes my last rubber, I think. And now I don't have any anymore. Then it's in the cano, it's ours. I really hate that mechanic where things just uh, switch around. It's like, uh, yeah, we found rubber. Alright, good. We're, uh, we already are making it done, so that's so useless. Now I got no tropical wood, and uh, probably. And now it's in high demand because all the tropical wood is turning into rubber. That's just stupid. Okay, well. So. Uh, let's build another factory here because. Yeah, that luxury factory isn't gonna do much. But luxury cloths. Hmm. Winery, lumber mill. No, that's not really anything I need. Paper mill. Maybe. It requires timber. Yeah, let's build a paper mill. I'm gonna have to subsidize this as well, and that's gonna cost me a ton of money. More or less resurgence. Um, what in favor of moralism? Uh, well. Or lose militancy. Now, how many people are those? Moralism. Yeah, that's 7.2%. Sure. Just as I was getting enough money, everything went to hell. So, yeah, not sure what to do with all of this. So, I'm gonna stop uh, encouraging craftsmen back here because I got nowhere to place them. this and put it someplace else, perhaps in uh, Kano. Yeah, let's put it back in Kano. Or I could uh, encourage clerks in Kano. We have a few back here. That should help with the efficiency, but it's only because certain pubs down there have over 50% uh, literacy. Okay. And Bolivia goes bankrupt. Well, at this rate, I'm gonna be following him, so... Right, need more money. And uh, I'm taxing my people a lot now. And I don't really have much of a choice, do I? Let's lower uh, administration spending a little bit. Because it is costing me a lot. Tensions in Kano, nope. Also, I could lower uh, military spending just a bit. I'm not going to war anyway. Okay. Is that enough? That's a lot of uh, subsidizing. So we'll be subsidizing this one soon as well. Once the uh, budget drops to zero. I'm probably gonna close this one. Well, yeah, of course, I'm gonna close this one down because nothing much to do with it. And this one will require timber, which isn't great since I don't have that much. And the Oyo Way? Or is it May? I think it's Way. <laughs> uh, okay. Lose consciousness, that's good. have that much iron anymore. Let's take another quick look. Production up to uh, 7.9. It's gonna go up eventually. Uh, we got a, a bunch more people here now and we got a bunch of migration as well. Should be seeing it go up. Yeah. So it's going rather quickly but uh, not quickly enough. Once we get uh, cheap steel we got a, a little more as well. And I'm gonna need more railroads too and I'm gonna need 
a lot of stuff. Gonna need some more upgrades here. Uh, probably artillery. Oh, well, it was on the green for a moment. <laughs> and also have a bunch of diplomacy points. Attention to Ducati. Nope. Alright. And we got another ship. That's good. Should be able to build more. Though I don't have a lot of money, but... Uh, Let's build two. Again, that's not good. Luckily there's a lot of tension down here as well, so hopefully no one cares. <laughs> oh, and the Germans are back. Alright, oh, they're uh, fighting against France. almost have cheap steel which should increase my income once again uh, San Francisco earthquake well that's not good and next research I was gonna go for I should also go for naval plans because I want that extra supply now I don't know if supply range uh, means okay let's first do this one um, 300 pounds that's not a lot to piss off people so let us uh, just give them a bunch of consciousness. So yeah, uh, the uh, supply range, I'm not entirely sure. I think it's about uh, your ships if you sent them away. So, oh yeah, there it says supply range. So at the moment I'd be able to move these guys up to here. And to more supply range, I might be able to reach, uh, I don't know, Belgium or no, not yet. It's plus ten percent. So I think it starts about at about uh, two hundred and fifty or something. So it wouldn't be enough yet. I uh, don't even know if I need it, but I see this would be about one hundred days. It's not a lot, but I gotta focus on other things. Um, let's get uh, some artillery first. I'm actually over my limit. I didn't notice that. Let's get rid of this one. And yeah, let's expand this naval base. That's uh, once again a lot of money. But, uh, I'm luckily in the green again, so that's good. I'm gonna wait a little while before I start to juggle with my money again. I think the uh, factory was completed or not. No, the distillery factory is still going. And we got uh, oh, 14,000 unemployed people in Benin. That's a lot. I'm gonna need uh, another level on something. Uh, let's see, the factory that's doing good. It's hard to come by nowadays. They're all, uh, they all have a very low budget. I guess that's partly because I do have uh, my tariffs, so... I'm gonna have to gamble, so... I think the one with explosives is doing pretty well, but uh, it does rely on ammunition. Well, let's just do explosives again. In the meantime, we can also make more troops. Oh, oh wait, that was steel production. That's not useful. All right, let's build some more infantry everywhere. Gonna have to be really careful with my money. Uh, reforms. Still gonna piss off the suffrage people. Let's see, movements. Yeah, suffrage and common school. Okay. How's this going? Looks like Switzerland jumped over me, mainly because of prestige, somehow. I've just completed railroad. Okay, that's good. Oh, 
oh no, you completed the factory back here, the distillery. So they should give me a bunch more taxes, but uh, I might upgrade it again. Because I'm fairly sure that this will be necessary. Let's do it. Oh, well, actually, I don't have a lot of money. I should have been uh, more careful. Let's focus on, on these ones. Oh, tensions into Kari. Nope. And some more projects going, but uh, we don't actually have any capitalists, so I'm not sure who's actually doing that. Although, let's take another look at oil. No, we got no capitalists, so I have absolutely no idea who built that liquor factory, unless it was me. And I didn't notice. <laughs> Alright. Oh, oh, wait a minute. Okay, well, this could be interesting. A crisis about Hossa land. No, wait. The Netherlands was actually going to back. Okay, that would have been bad. Luckily, uh, it failed to enlist any more people. Okay, need more research. So, uh, now we got uh, better artillery. I'm going to need even more artillery, but uh, I need more commerce as well, possibly, or industry. The railroad could be good. Yeah, let's go for the railroad. That also allow me to get an extra level back here for uh, more iron. It's up to 8.9. That's good. Not sure what else to do back here. I'm building as much as I can and I don't have that much money left. I'm already uh, cutting the budget on certain things. Um, let's lower some of the tariffs. Let's see if I can that way also lower my subsidies a little bit. Not sure if it's gonna work. Let's take a look. I'm subsidizing too much, I don't have much of a choice. What if I just uh, drop it all? Let's go to 0% and see if it uh, balances out. Then we can do some more taxes. I'd really like to drop these taxes because we're almost at uh, 50%, but because all the stupid events that got rid of my uh, tropical wood, I uh, don't have much of a choice, and my industry isn't big enough yet to uh, make a lot of people work there. Okay. What about these clerks? How is this progressing? Oh, we got a, an okay amount, but not enough. At about 20% uh, clerks is uh, the maximum that you can get, so... Yeah, we're very far away from that. Let's take a look actually. Uh, and here we should be able to see. Yeah, well. We have 10,000 unemployed in Benin. They still gotta wait. So. Let's uh, get rid of this focus for now. And let's put a focus on. Biafra again, perhaps. Still got a bit of room back here. Oh, maybe I'm gonna upgrade this one again. Although I don't have a lot of money. And I'm gonna need money for all these railroads, so I'm gonna keep it. And it doesn't look like this is going down all too much. 
it's even going up and down and up. Uh, third way, no idea what this is about. Yeah, the budget is a mess. More prestige, okay. And I got more diplomacy points that I should be spending, so let's spend some more with Portugal. As we did before, and with Italy, who is apparently getting attacked by some people. At war with... No, he isn't. Because it's uh, rebels. Yeah. And it's gonna take a long time before those uh, railroads are done, so... Yeah, I can't really rely on that to get my money back. At least not uh, yet. But once they are done, I'm gonna get uh, quite a bit of money. In the meantime, we're still waiting for some of the factories to be completed. I could, of course, just drop my uh, military spending, or, well, uh, my uh, spending on supplies. Uh, what do we got? More tension, once again. Hmm. You know what, I'm just gonna up tariffs again. I don't really have much of a choice. Because it doesn't look like it's dropping the subsidies all too much. At least this way I can be in the green. Or at least around the green. So let's take a look. Um, rebels, uh, nothing much. Reforms. Well, you know what, let's just uh, do it. There we go. Up to 30% literacy now. It's going nice. Double standard. Oh, good. More uh, tax efficiency. People are still fairly happy, so that's good. Except for a few of the poor people, but... And we got the railroads, excellent. So, um, the German Dutch summit. Okay, uh, let us uh, start off building a railroad here. And I'm not gonna build them everywhere yet, only in the big uh, states and big provinces, especially these uh, industrial provinces. gonna cost me quite a bit of money in total. Um, let's actually wait with that. As I don't exactly want to bankrupt myself. Uh, yes, more research. So... Commerce, perhaps. More uh, administrative efficiency, maybe. Or more prestige. Not sure what I was gonna do. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I guess I'm actually gonna figure it out next time because uh, it looks like this episode has been pretty long. So thank you very much for watching and see you next time.